I'm Earth Renaissance Oil's Vice President of Business Development, Kevin Smith. Uh, Kevin, talk to us about Renaissance Oil and all the exciting things that are coming up in the next few months. Well, we were uh, founded two years ago specifically to go into Mexico with opening up of the oil markets there that have been protected for the past 80 years. And we've developed a foothold now and we're looking for some pretty rapid growth over the next years. And I understand that you're onshore. Uh, talk to us why that is an opportunity for, for Renaissance Oil. Well, onshore is a better place for small growth companies to focus. The larger players are mostly focused offshore, as has Pemex been for the past few decades. And I think that Pemex has left behind some fantastic opportunities that were just a bit small in scale for them and uh, for more, more focused offshore. So we're focused onshore. We think there's a lot of uh, stuff that's been left behind. And what kind of values uh, can you promise for shareholders? Well, we've established a pretty good uh, base set of production that we think we can grow. It's a great foothold, something that we could probably double, triple over the next year and really start to add value for shareholders, all the while looking for the next big prize, which we think uh, is just around the corner. And I'm sure that you get questions um, all the time about challenges uh, for Renaissance Oil. How are you overcoming some of those challenges? Well. As the process of reform has been rolled out in Mexico, it's been a bit little slower than most of the people would uh, had anticipated or liked. Uh, but when opportunities have arisen, we've been aggressive in acquiring them and adding them to our portfolio for growth in the future. And we've been pretty successful at that. Now I understand Mr. Ian Telfor is on your team. Uh, what about him makes you guys stand out? Well, Ian's uh, done a fantastic job putting this group together to focus after oil and of course he's built a business and resources before in Mexico with Gold Corp and, and uh, you know his experience in there and giving us the vision for long-term success has really paved the way and shaped our business plan to kind of give it a long-term focus. Thank you so much for talking to us on Small Cap Power. Well, thank you. For more videos at the Toronto Capital Conference, make sure you watch more of them on Small Cap Power.